here at the Rocky Mountain Arsenal near Denver. And we're hoping to see... Eagles. <gasps> bald, as in bald eagles. eagles. Bald eagles. Bald eagles. Yeah. Ah, They're bald. Some bison, maybe? Maybe. Ah. Mm -hmm. Okay. Let's, uh, let's go. Let's go down the... Yeah. We got our cameras ready. We got our coffee. Yep. We're good. <gasps> let's go see. Yep. So that, that's the dam to the side, right? I don't see any eagles so far. So, uh, Lower Derby Lake is a just... Not a lake anymore. A bowl. So This used to be the place to go this time of year for bald eagles. This whole platform would be full of photographers with tripods just having a heyday with a dozen, two dozen, three dozen bald eagles just mm -hmm. flying in and out of here and landing in those trees and those trees. And it was just so cool and fun. And I kind of suspected it would be like this. Last time we were here with that was like three years ago. Mm -hmm. And the last two summers have been pretty dry. Real dry. <laughs> yeah, very dry. Very yeah. dry. And we, they, we're in extreme drought right now. We're, it's quite a drought. So I'm super disappointed. It was an hour drive to get here. <sighs> wow, this is sad. We know of another lake where we can probably see bald eagles. Um, but we're going to do the rest of the loop. This uh, Rocky Mountain Arsenal, I think that's what it's called. Mm -hmm. It usually has, a, a, it does have a whole herd or two of bison and that's on the driving portion. There's not walking in there, of course. So this part of the park, we could kind of walk around down the trails. Uh, shortly, we'll get to a loop where we just drive and you can just really just roll down your window and take pictures of bison, which is kind of cool too. Yeah. Yeah. Um, so we'll show you some of that. There's also deer. We're looking at like three deer laying in the grass right now uh, and a variety of of hawks so we're gonna you know obviously explore yep but Let's this is disappointing happens. it is i'm kind of bummed well maybe that's why we've got so many eagles in our backyard yeah <laughs> dang it yep all right okay all right well that's moving on i guess What do we got up here? Buffalo. Are bison. They? What? American, American bison. They're bison. Bison. Not buffalo. Bison. <laughs> What's the difference, Steve? Buffaloes have long horns, bison have short horns. Don't know. Are you making it up? I'm making it up as I go. All right. Yep. Makes a good story and I'm sticking to it. Okay. Steve has found a bald eagle at the top of a distant tree, as well as a, just a small, small portion of the herd of bison. This is cool so far. Oh, and the light during this time of year is so pretty, and there's still a little snow here. How nice! Look at the snow. Got a couple bison right here. Hello, bison. We're gonna stop back here. Oh, that's kind of a cool shot, yeah. We're pulled way off the side of this one-way road, just like everyone else. 
off to the side and someone just went by and honked loudly, bison right there, that we were in their way. <laughs> if you go to a wildlife refuge, don't be in a damn hurry. This is what we do. We're pulled off to the right side of the road. Way off to the side, there's plenty of room for everyone to get around. Don't go to a wildlife refuge if you're short on time and are gonna be a total jerk. <laughs> PSA, I had to get off, off, my, off my chest. Also, somehow bicyclists are out here and they're not supposed to be. Oof. Oh, oh gosh. Denver in the background. Right over there. Maybe right where that truck, that car stuck might be a good place. Okay. Well, we drove the whole loop. It was about 10 miles. Yep, a little more. Yeah, I think we got some really quality time with some nice bison. Yes. Yeah, and some really nice light. It's pretty overcast now, but an hour ago it was nice. Yeah, we got some decent light on bison. Yeah. I've got a little prairie dog action here and there. Oh yeah. <laughs> I did see some hawks way in the distance, but nothing worth a photo. Uh, several deer. We always see yeah. deer out here. And one bald eagle? One, possibly two bald oh, eagles. Oh, possibly way two. Way in the distance. Way off. There's nothing for them to eat here. <laughs> yeah. Uh, so I think it, it's a, a nice place to drive through. It's very close to Denver. Uh, mm -hmm. It's just nice. If you, uh, you know, when you come to these, you never know what you're going to see. Um, so just go slow, keep an eye out, maybe bring binoculars. I can't find mine. Um, don't be like that jerk who was honking at people to go faster and get out of the way. That was just silly. <laughs> uh, but you really don't know what you're going to see out here. Uh, I've had a friend who's seen a badger. I have seen burrowing owls, massive amounts of deer and bald eagles. You just, you just don't ever know yeah. what you're going to see. Yep. I think it was still a good uh, first foray out into the new year. Yeah. There's actually snow on the ground. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> oh, yeah, because you're like, oh, look, it's going to snow. Yeah. Yeah. And it had two snowstorms in one week. Thank you very much. Oh, <laughs> uh, yeah. Uh, we're going to move on, and uh, we'll see you in the next one. Yep. See ya. Okay, bye. Bye. <sighs> What are you doing? <laughs> <laughs>